So turning now to Athens City, according to officials there, more people are moving to the city, resulting in new developments and projects to keep up with that growth. New houses are popping up left and right, but one city council member is working to make sure developers build quality homes. News 19's Lindsay Smith explains. Athens City Councilman Harold Wells says the city is growing fast, and with that growth, comes the need for housing. I'm not bashing any, any developer. Hey, we need them here, but we want them here to keep Athens looking beautiful. Councilman Wells says there are several new developers across the city building new subdivisions. He says some of these houses barely meet city code. Where we all thought they were gonna be a brick frontage and stuff like that, they're not any brick. They got McCar they've got what they call hardy board going from the roof all the way to the ground. And a lot of them, the foundations are not even covered. For reference, these are what the homes look like. You can go down and see them yourself on Lindsay Lane, Anderson Homes, and out on Cambridge Lane, and you will see they're not very nice in the neighborhood. Wales is working with city staff, engineers, the planning board, and the rest of the council to modify its city ordinances, hoping that it'll fix what he and some residents say is an issue. We need to add some language in it that will not allow them to build these houses to the very bare minimum. And the people that lives next to where these cheap homes are being built, they're upset because they look at it's downgrade in their neighborhoods. Reporting in Athens, Lindsay Smith, News 19. Councilman Wales says conversations are underway right now in regard to making changes to city ordinances. He says they hope to have the language finalized and presented at one of their city council meetings for a vote sometime in December.